Gaffer, points on the road, how do you assess that one? <coughs> um, well, a good point at the end of the game. I mean, obviously Dover are on a good run. Um, they've had some good results, uh, you know, notably knocking Southend out of the cup here, away at Yeovil. You know, they, they've been taking some scalps. However, however, um, we were absolutely miles off the pace in the first half, nowhere near it. Started slowly and, and fell away, to be honest with you. Um, didn't get on any seconds, didn't win any showed a uh, lack of energy all over the pitch. You know, the air dryer comes out at half time and to flip your lid again, away from home. You know, I'm saying to the boys, uh, come on, you know, we're six on the belt at home, a club record equal to club record. And we need to now start performing like that away from home. And for whatever reason, I don't know what it is and I can't put my finger on it, we don't. Second half after a, a volley of you know, my dissatisfaction, if you like. I thought we livened up, um, uh, began began to compete more for the first, began to get a little bit more on the seconds, began to get some territory and a little bit more quality ball higher up the pitch. Um, you know, I listen in the end, one of the few bits of quality that we produced in 90 minutes got us the goal. It's, it's just, you know, I was right behind it. It's a great free kick. The goal has got no chance, but we need to do better. We need to do better, and that's the disappointing thing. But Let's be fair. We should have been we should have been out of sight at half time. You know they they could have come in two or three nil up, and I couldn't have had any complaints. So in the end, it's a good point. Like you say, perhaps to ride, ride that wave in the first half. Fortunate to get in level at the break. In the end, pleasing to overall get the point though. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I think that's the the, the the key element of the game for me is that we've took a point from somewhere where we've not played well. Uh, we haven't for me we haven't performed today. You know and and. Oh. I'm at a loss really to put my finger on it. You know, we, we go to Harlepool and get a win, uh, but for 30 minutes in the first half, again we sort of you know we're, we're sort of last gasp defending a little bit, and then we finally get get a handle on the game and, and and grow into it and end up winning it. You know, but I've just said to them in there, you know, I, I want more. I want more than that. You know, I, we need to be coming away from home and replicating what we're doing at home, and I've got to find out why we're not. You know, I mean, listen. Uh, historically in the last couple of years it's not been an easy ground to come to as for op opposition teams and we've got a fantastic record there but we have to take that on the road with us um, but listen if, if you're winning at home and drawing away then you're going to have a decent season but I want more. We certainly have to be more aggressive and more more brutal in, in the way we approach games away from home and it's something that I'll speak with my staff about on the way home and um, obviously we're away again on Tuesday at, at Stockport you know and I want to I want to start digging out a few reasons why you know we 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 aren't winning, picking up more three points away from. Because if we do, if we do, then um, you know we're going to have a good season.